Okay, cut into the chase here. This is a whirlpool. Front loading clothes washer. It would stop working in the middle of a cycle and we'd get some weird error message on the display which we indicated that it was having some sort of a draining issue. The problem was found in this round thingy which is located at the bottom and front of the washer directly and conveniently behind the face panel. It's actually a filter that functions as a catch basket designed to stop large items from getting to the water pump and causing serious damage. This is what we found. You are forewarned this is gross. And there was the problem. It stinks too. A quarter, another quarter, a dime. I've already saved 60 cents. A blindfold, a piece of the toothpick, another quarter, and a lot of hair. Ew! Now, with that thing out, you can see inside of here. That's not too bad in there. So it means this thing here is doing its job. Okay, this time I have my wife's toothbrush. Good enough. Now this part is very important. Don't forget to put it back in. Keep in mind there is a tab at the top of this piece here that lines up with a slot at the top of this hole. And that keeps the tray in the upright position, leaving this part to spin freely and thread into place. Okay, while you're at this and cleaning up the uh, clothes washer, uh, don't forget to clean up the uh, soap dispensing tray as well too. It comes apart and you can scrub it up and get it all nice and cleaned up. Um, I already cleaned mine. I forgot to take a video of it. You don't want to watch that anyway. Um, don't forget that underneath this tray, at the bottom of this tray, there's this piece here. And it, uh, it snaps into place here. And uh, I had to very carefully take it off so I don't break this tab that holds it in place. Um, but when I took it off, and I cleaned it out. Uh, before I cleaned it out, there was a whole bunch of this dark matter. <laughs> not, well, I'm not getting into this. Anyway, um, anyway, when I took this off, there was a whole lot of just black gunk inside of this. And uh, I scrubbed it out, got it looking nice and clean again. And uh, right there is actually a little speck of black gunk left over. I've got to take care of that. There, it's gone. All right, now. So that'll snap back on a place like so, and, uh, and it's all ready to go. We hope you found this video helpful. The next video in this two-part series will show how to take apart the washer. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.